Bunny. Hey, I'm Braid. So I told a lot of my friends over the years that if there was a game that was just MMO rating, it would be a massive hit. So this game is Rabbit and Steel. It is the closest thing I could find to a dedicated rating game. So I played a little bit. I'm just trying out all the classes. And this is the Dancer Bunny. Very uh, inspired by a certain other game. Clearly. So let's go ahead and try this class out. Just going to show you what this ga uh, game's like. So really, it's like a class-based bullet hell type game. some loot from the next room by attacking this loot box. Um, this thing looks insane, this abyss artifact. Yeah, I think I'm going to go for that. Thing is, though, to use a defensive, I have to, like, be in trouble, and I don't intend on, like, getting in much trouble. You know what I mean? That's, uh, it could save my butt. I'm gonna try out my defensive. There we go. Could just use it more as a buff during, uh, slow periods. But I don't know, maybe I should save it for danger times, whenever I sense that I get in danger. But obviously, like I said, the goal is to never be in danger. So it's going to be hard for me to use it. But I know I will mess up a lot. Let's see. Uh, abilities and loot that hit more than once deal thir Okay. Yeah, we'll go for that. Because I have two abilities that hit twice. Yeah, so... I, really, really good. Really good. Really good items. Keep in mind, this is normal mode, so things are a little slow. That was pretty fast. That was pretty good. I get to go to the shop and see what the shop has. Uh, okay, so there's this special upgrade for my, for my special. Looks like it increases the recast to 99 seconds, but since, like, using my other abilities pretty much resets it anyway, I don't see a downgrade at all. I don't know what luck means. No idea what luck means. We'll try it out. Let's, let's see what, let's see what happens. So I don't know what the luck potion is supposed to do. I think it just activates for this next stage. Okay. So I've got balls headed towards the thingamabobber. Yeah. 
That was... That was pretty clean. Alright. That's a lot of levels. Still don't know what Lux, Luck did. Okay. So this chains thing keeps me in one uh, vertical row for a little bit. That's totally fine. I'm invincible, baby, for eight seconds. All right, maybe I didn't put myself in a good spot. There we go. That was clean as well. Oh, I think I understand what the stage is. It's actually like the full white bar at the top. That's what the stage is. Okay, I have no idea what luck is. I still, still, still no clue. The cacophony of night. Yeah. So one critique I have is I think they introduced this teleport mechanic way too soon in the game. That's my only real critique so far. Otherwise, this, this game's pretty good. Uh, it's kind of hard to tell what, what I am doing sometimes, but I think that's just a skill issue on my part. seconds of invincibility, I can go balls deep. Right. During a period that didn't really matter. Oh shit. I took... I did not take damage, actually. Okay, now I took damage. I, uh, made a mistake with the mechanics, so that was just a skill issue there. side of the balls. The mechanic is called get in the circle, but I don't want to be in the circle sometimes. I want to be outside of it so I can teleport in. So if I have a teleport, that means just do the opposite of be in the circle. Alright, treasure time. We can get something that gives me more uh, health. I think luck may, might have something to do with, uh, with, like, critical strikes and shit. Let's get this Crescent Moon Dagger. This seems it's a lot, like, it's a lot better than this. Yeah. Alright. So now I think I got the boss. So let's go kill the boss. not have done I should have not planted myself in the uh, way of the balls I wanna go here I think okay I have to be in the left ball then in that case I 
There we go. Save myself. Became invincible. Ah, oh, shit. I fucked up. Oh, no, no, no. Okay. I almost got hit again. Like a newbie. Center, sides, and then center again. Okay. So what that what did was it would just tell you like what skills are about to go out. Stay out. Okay. Out, stay out. There we go. Okay, now I'm going to generate balls around me. What, what hit me? What? Oh, I know it hit me. Okay, I'm just, I'm just being foolish now. Stay out. Stay out. All right. There we go. Okay. That's good. I think this is it. There we go. Awesome. So yeah, that's the first area boss, at least. Let's see how far I can get with this. I think I got a pretty good setup. <sighs> Church Mouse Streets. Ooh, talk. Lore. Do you like music? Oh, it's a frog girl. What's going on here? Sure. Have you heard of Avi? I guess you must have. You haven't. I can see it in your face. I've been a big fan of hers forever, or well, sort of. I knew her before her recent popularity, you know? She was super, super underwater before, you know? No one knew her. Da -da 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 okay, thank you. Let's see what's in the shop. Um... So I think Sapphire, Ruby, Emerald, etc. I think those are like tiers of upgrades. Um, yo, this is a straight up upgrade. This is a straight up like strictly better upgrade because I have that thing that boosts per hit damage. So I'll do that. Let's restore our health. Don't do anything stupid. <laughs> Too late. Okay. Get in the line. Okay. It's more bullet hell. See how far I can get with this setup. I don't know anything past this. Oh shit, I'm stupid. 
I didn't get in the line like the game instructs me to. I, I just got to follow the directions. I couldn't do that. All right. Unlocked. The rabbit you control deals over 500 damage in this fight. I don't. I didn't. I didn't catch that full message. Um. Let's keep going. Heavy, making fun of my weight. Okay, I have to keep like doing this weird zigzag dodging thing. Oh, this is mesmerizing, but the uh, ooh shininess might be my downfall. Shininess might be my downfall here. Alright, let's keep going. Uh, okay, that's the path that the circles are taking then. I have no idea what's going on here. Oh, they traded. I don't understand anymore. Stretch to tether. Okay. I did it. I think. Oh, they, they even out their health. Okay. Stretch the tether. Okay. Meg and Rose Mage Mouse. Oh, shit. What the fuck is damaging me? I don't understand. I don't quite understand what the fuck was damaging me there. Stretch the tether. Okay, I'm stretching the tether. Not quite sure what the hell is going on. Okay, I'm stretching the tether. Oh, the pink means I'm good then, right? Is that what it means? If it's purple, it's bad, but if it's pink, I'm good. Oh, that was so fucking close. Alright, so... Jesus Christ! Ah, oh, damn it. Well... <laughs> damn, that was crazy. It, it, it escalated really fast. Alright, so... Let's see what I have that carried over. Because it's supposed to be a roguelite. And I'm trying to see if there's something that carried over for me. Uh, so let's see. Did I do I have anything that carried over or what? I've had this. I thought something was supposed to carry over, or am I wrong? I guess I was wrong. Anyway. That's all for now. I just wanted to show you this game. I wanted to show you the Dancer Rabbit. So apparently, apparently there's going to be even more rabbit classes than this. There's so many bunnies, man. It's just overwhelmingly fluffy. That's that's all it is. It's overwhelmingly fluffy. All right. Anyway, thank you for watching. Remember, like, subscribe, buy my merch. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching.